everybody, Dr. Michael Shear here. It's Saturday, but I had to run back to the office to do something pretty cool. I just got the notification uh, from the team at 3Shape that they finally released their updated dental desktop, which allows us to go ahead and export color from our Trio scanners. It's really pretty amazing. I just had to run back in and get that installed. So the neatest part about this is now is, is that 3Shape Trios allows me to export color scans in POI file format directly from my Trio scanner into a USB drive, desktop, network file, anything. 3Shape makes this pretty easy. Let me go ahead and show you and demonstrate with this full implant rehab case. And I'll go ahead and export these files and then I'll go ahead and show you what the POI file format looks like in another program. So what I'm gonna do here is go back to the main screen and uh, pull up our patient's file. And when I click on the last scan of any of the scans that I have in the file system, I have my patient here that I did an intraoral scan on for a full arch rehab on upper and lower scan bodies. I can go to any existing scan that 3Shape has available. Just click on export and then click on the scans button. So I just select which scan it is, right click, export scans, and then I can go ahead and choose any file format that I want, DCM, STL, or color POY. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose color POY, and then I'm gonna go ahead and export to Trios POY, and I'll give it a name like Trios POY, and it will export to my desktop. Let's go ahead and take a look at what these files look like in another program, and let's go right to that. Let's go ahead and take a look at our POI file formats in MeshMixer and some other softwares. So I've gone ahead and I've exported the files here to our patient's folder here on my computer. Just for also good measure, I went ahead and I uh, exported as STL so that way I can compare the mesh density of the POI file formats from Trios and the STL file formats. I'm gonna go ahead and open up a mesh mixer uh, application and let's go ahead and drag in our upper jaw scan. So I'll bring in the STL file format of this patient. And here's our STL file. So it looks pretty good, looks pretty clean. Let me go ahead and drag in our PLY and I'm gonna append it to mesh mixer so that way I can compare the differences between the two. So here it is in color, that's the PLY. And here it is in black and white, which is the STL. So looking here at our kind of files, everything here looks pretty good. Let me also go ahead and drag in our abutments. So I'll drag in both our STL and POI file formats of our scan bodies. And here are our scan bodies. This right here is our STL file format, so I can go ahead and turn that off. And now you'll be able to see really nice color definition here of our uh, scan bodies in place. So let's go ahead and turn on the wireframe mode here in Mesh Mixer. And we can see here, this is what the mesh density looks like in the PLY file format. And here it is in the STL file format. That looks pretty identical. Let's go ahead and take a look at in our jaw scan. Here is our jaw scan. So our jaw scan has very, very tight mesh density around where we defined our abutments. And comparing that also with our STL. Identical. Let's go ahead and bring these files into ExoCAD. So I went ahead and I imported our PLYs into ExoCAD just to kind of show you the power of being able to go ahead and have color rendering uh, within the Trios architecture. Now the neat part is, is, is that yes, there are other scanners that have been allowing you to go ahead and export color for some time, but the neat part is, is, is that 3Shape went ahead and recognized the abilities of many clinicians as well as kind of the desire of a lot of clinicians to be able to use the power of the 3Shape Trio scanner and the simplicity, and then also the versatility of being able to have color scans uh, in other software packages other than the 3Shape dental system software. So 3Shape, I give a big thumbs up for being able to allow color POI file formats from the 3Shape Trios. I know this is a feature I'm gonna use readily in my clinical practice. Dr. Michael Shear, thanks for tuning in.